Imagine this, you're on a work trip to Japan, eager to impress your colleagues. You nail the presentation, but when it comes to the celebratory dinner, things get awkward. You reach across the table to grab the soy sauce, only to meet a chorus of confused stares. Turns out, in Japan, reaching over others at the table is a major faux pas. This, my friends, is the hidden minefield of unspoken social rules that exist across cultures. These unwritten codes, often passed down through generations, dictate everything from greetings to tipping etiquette. Here's where the wisdom of ancient philosophers comes in, offering timeless insights to navigate this social labyrinth. Confucius, the Chinese master, emphasized the importance of Li, ritual propriety. Li isn't just about manners, it's about acting in harmony with social norms to avoid disruption. Think of Li as the social GPS, guiding you through the cultural landscape without causing cultural fender benders. But what about situations where cultures clash? Here, the Stoic philosophy of Epictetus offers valuable advice. He reminds us to focus on what we can control. While we can't control ingrained social norms of other cultures, we can control our own actions and reactions. A little research before your trip, a willingness to learn, and a dash of humility go a long way. Let's bring this back to your coffee date. Imagine you accidentally break an unspoken rule, perhaps double dipping your fries, a major offense in some circles. Here's where another philosophical gem shines, virtue ethics from Aristotle. This philosophy emphasizes developing virtues like self-awareness and social intelligence. A quick apology, a lighthearted laugh, and a genuine effort to understand the other person's perspective can go a long way in smoothing over any cultural hiccups. Ultimately, these ancient philosophies offer a valuable toolkit for navigating the social world. By understanding Li, focusing on what we can control, and cultivating virtuous behavior, we can avoid social blunders and foster genuine connection, whether it's across continents or across a crowded coffee shop. Remember, sometimes the most valuable lessons in life aren't written in textbooks, but are woven into the fabric of our everyday interactions. So the next time you find yourself in an unfamiliar social situation, take a deep breath, channel your inner philosopher, and navigate the social labyrinth with confidence and grace.